Okay there guys, so um, uh, today I'm in uh, Tsukiji, uh, this is um, on video, this is uh, round two, but uh, fictional, It's uh, in real life sorry, it's round three. Uh, first time in Tsukiji, um, turned out they weren't actually doing the, the famous tuna auction at all, so we uh, missed out on that. Second time, um, we got there at like 4am when registration is supposed to start but we got told that they'd already basically finished. They'd already done it all by 2.30, so back again today. I'm gonna to get there about 12.30 tonight and uh, try to make sure that I'm at the front. I'm not fucking it up again. So, yeah, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. So, right, anyway, I'm particularly pleased because uh, there's some shopping today. Um, in a few days, I'm going to be going to uh, an adventure park uh, in Shimizu Koen. And uh, there's like outdoor course that's all like covered in water and you've got to do like running and jumping and that sort of stuff. And I figure I'm going to fall in and screw it up a lot, so it should be a bit of a laugh. I want to video it, but the camera that I'm using right now is not suitable for water and I can't really be climbing stuff one-handed. So, I bought this. So this is the uh, Sony HDR-AS200VR camera. Uh, it's a waterproof camera and it also has a remote control watch part on it. So uh, I got this. Uh, I got myself uh, the SanDisk 32 megabyte, uh, gigabyte memory card. So. Um, you know, I, I don't. I want to have make sure I've got enough space to record for a couple hours solid without having to worry. So I've got this as well. Uh, also got a head and hat clamp for the camera. So uh, like in the picture you see here, uh, I can actually wear this on my head as either a band or attach it like onto goggles if I wear them for something like that, or I can clip it straight onto a baseball cap underneath. So well, I'll wear a baseball cap that day and I'll have it so I've got a camera on the side of my face, which would be nice. And then I'm worried about battery life. So the last thing I got is a spare battery and charger. So uh, this also comes with a micro USB cable so that I can just plug it into like my mobile battery and charge as well. So that's gonna be useful. So uh, I'm, I'm really liking this presentation like case it comes with. It's uh, very sexy. So let's uh, open this up and have a proper look at it. Da, 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 da. Open, 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 open. I'm getting frustrated now. I want to open it out. This must be all the cables and things. Yep. So, first of all, we have. First of all, we have the uh, watch piece. So uh, I'm gonna take my watch off. Let's yeah, see how it works. So basically, I can put this straight onto my arm, and then I can operate it like a remote control. So uh, I can choose the power. Uh, what's it got on there? It's got power, uh, zooming function, record, stop. Uh, menu and display options and uh, what's this thing open? What's this? Oh that's for the USB charging so I can charge this with USB as you can see in there and this this too is fully waterproof as well so I don't have to worry about getting any water on this and it's got a nice rubber design on it so it doesn't pull on my hairs which is nice but uh, it doesn't slip which is even better, so it's not going to be slipping around under. It's quite comfortable to wear, I don't really notice it. So, you know, that's part one. And uh, the main part, if I can get this without tearing it to pieces and frustration, come on, open. Yes, excellent. So, main part, how do I open Okay. What? Oh, yes. Very, very nice. It seems I need some kind of screwdriver to get this off. <laughs> Shit. Right, that key's a little too big. 
Let's use. Ah! Yeah, that'll do it. Take a minion. Oh, wrong way. Ah, there we go. Yay! So, I've got one camera. So, this is like the locking mechanism for it because you can take the actual camera itself. I have no idea how though. Maybe I have to lift that up. I don't know. Ah, that's it. So, just gonna slide that out. Yep. So, yeah, that's the actual camera itself. So, uh,. It's got a discrete display on there. I'm not really sure what that's for at the moment, but uh, this, this opens. That is the, oh, that's the USB, maybe for charging. And then we have, what was this one? Yep. Our HDMI out. Um, Bot knows what that is. Don't know. And this is, a, this is for power. And then this open. Oh, there we go. One. Ah, that's for the battery and memory card. So uh I can clamp that all in there. And ooh, okay, okay, lock, open, lock, open. Wow, so that's the camera. Case, pretty rugged, quite solid. And you've got the allowance for the stereo on there for recording as well, so you can catch voices and things. So, nice, very nice. And then this is, obviously you put this, you put this all in there, and then this clamps down. And then this this basically acts like a a lock. Then that's it. It's all in, sealed up. And if I want to record, I can just press this and uh, use the remote. So that's it for today. So uh, I'm gonna have a another look at this a bit later with it all set up and uh, can have a little bit of fun with this now and get it all charged and ready to go. So uh, yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll catch you guys later.
Okay, so just finished at the uh, tuna auction, which you had already seen. So, uh, I love egg as much as uh, any other human being does. If you don't like egg, you're probably a demon or something. But uh, this is a uh, famous egg in Skiji, so I'm going to give this a go, see how nice it is. Mmm. Mmm. Very good. Very nice. Oh yeah. Right. Yeah, thumbs up, thumbs down. Thumbs up. Okay. Excellent. Yeah. Wow, this is nice. Mm. Very, very moist. Not too sweet. But absolutely fantastic. So uh I'm going to enjoy this in peace. Catch you guys later.